Und da sind wir auch schon wieder beim dritten Teil von Elevator to the Moon. Im letzten Teil ist uns der Motor rausgefallen und hat Feuer gefangen und ja, gucken wir mal, wie wir das lösen können. Access granted. Episode 3, The Rock. From the screen above you. Play episode. Please prepare to enjoy this elevating experience. Mm, episode 3. Wieder globally networked AI forced you to pass his complex test. You cheated. Ach, stimmt doch gar nicht. A mysterious hacking group has hacked the motor controls. You took care of them by blowing up the Norman AI. Now you leave Earth in the darkness of space. Once inside the now dormant asteroid, we will begin the docking procedure. Wait, what was that strange sound from the motor? No ah, matter. Genau. Now before I rude the intro, as I was saying, once we're inside the now dormant. Put out the fire right now, we have here a fire lesher. Access granted. Oh, you opened it for me? That's so nice of you. Now put out that fire right now! Good, now be quick about it. Put this damn fire out! Ah, how did you break it? Now the starter mode is falling from the ceiling. Now what are we gonna do, dum dum? Dum dum. Oh, we are in the world. We have here. Einpümpel und wir haben hier Akkuschrauber aufgeladen, den wollte ich schon immer haben, denn dann können wir hier die dämlichen Schrauben rausdrehen und gucken, was dahinter steckt. Tor 1. Oh. Tor 1, 2 oder 3? Ne, wir haben kein drittes Tor. Okay, ähm, sonst haben wir hier nichts zu schrauben. Uh, so, was haben wir hier? Noch ein Tape. What? Hey, Schnitzel, was kostet die nach? Was ist das? W Crew. What the hell? <laughs> My God. I can't read it from here. Ah, who cares? It's probably just saying how awesome I am. Eh. Eh. NASA Canada, Doug Slate, Rongmeyer, Evaluation, Intelligence, E+, plus, Strength, B+, plus, Obedience, uh, Obedience, F, uh, Rank, D-, minus, uh, also ziemlich uh, schlecht. Dann haben wir hier Phase 2, Lazarus, Lazarus. Current Status, uh, <laughs> Sample quality excellent. Can I sample Doc Slater Rock Meyer? Then we here. This is oh. a recording of Norman. If you are hearing this 
message, I may already be dead. It's a freaking Norman bomb. Get rid of it. Throw it in the trash. Trash. <laughs> there was a close one. They could have gotten messy for you. Oh. <laughs> Uh, huh? Oh. Wow, look at you, you big strong. Uh, <laughs> okay, now start the motor. Nice. Oh. Break the glass, dum dum. Boing, alles wieder runter. Wir nehmen das, machen das und machen so. Good. We're back to full power. Yeah, no thanks to you. Douglas, I was in low power mode, reverting my power to the life support systems. If I didn't, our pilot would have died. Yeah, excuses, excuses. And whatever. Our planet has survived, and now we can continue. We are approaching the rock, the asteroid that was on the trajectory to destroy Earth before we intervened, capturing it with Project Lasso. Yeah, and who saved everyone? It was me. I went up there. I grabbed that stupid rock. No problem. In truth, there were problems. It was far, far more complex than that. What do you mean, more complex than that? Hold that thought, Douglas. We're entering an asteroid belt. Caused by the struggle to contain the asteroid. Keep an eye on the hull's integrity. I'm closing the shutters now to protect the windows. You there, space pilot. Keep this elevator intact. Repair it! Oh, my beautiful elevator. You made it this far. Please don't get destroyed now. My approval ratings are riding on this. There's a fire in the back panel. Quickly, put it out. Yeah, put out the fire. You remember how to do that, right, Dum Dum? This elevator is burning up, and you will burn too if you don't hurry up and put that fire out. Yeah, 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 yeah. Das ganze Ding bricht auseinander und geht den Flammen auf. Hang on, we're almost there. There it is. You almost made it. Excellent work, pilot. We passed the asteroid field. I'm Juhu. now rotating the elevator to a forward-facing direction for our approach on the rock. Don't be alarmed if you notice the gravity echoing strangely. It's just the artificial gravity recalibrating. Brace yourself. This is going to get bumpy. attention. The rock is split in two. Both ends act as a gravitational tether for the elevator shaft. If you look down the cabin, beyond those doors, that's where we'll have to dock, transferring from one side to the other. This is where I'm most vulnerable to remote cyber attacks. You need to... Ah, shut up, Peter. So boring. What my pilot really wants to know. So I captured this bad boy and saved the world. Just look how big and scary this thing is.
President Doug Slater Rock? Why? Who is this? Why does he look like me? Peter, is this some kind of sick joke? The only joke around here is you. What you see before you, Douglas, isn't a clone. It's the corpse of the original Doug Slater Rockmeyer. A human could never save the world, but I could. The Earth needed a hero, and the original Rockmeyer, while a terrible astronaut, could be cloned very easily. Earth watched, and sure, Rockmeyer gave them a show, but like a skilled illusionist, they never saw my masterful bait and switch. President Doug Slater Rockmeyer, you're not a hero, you're a clone. This doesn't make sense. Why would you leave him to die? With the world united, Earth's hero was the perfect choice for a president. Douglas, you are a defiant puppet. But as your creator, I'm the one that is pulling your strings. Douglas? Douglas. Oh, he's gone. Well, fair enough, it's quite a lot to take in. Not every day you learn that you're a clone. Now, we're about to complete phase two of my plan. The plan that completes this moon elevator. We must press on. I will initiate the docking procedure. If something goes wrong, Oi. you need to follow this specific step-by-step -step process very carefully. Otherwise, you'll be stuck here till your oxygen runs out and you die. Step one. If there is a power failure, it is imperative that you... What? Deletion in progress. We saw. No. Um. Uh? Press a button to acknowledge. Resurrect function. Yeah. Pilot, I'm Vida. My entire global network of data centers are being deleted. Press a button to acknowledge. To save me, to save this mission, you need to upload me onto Hefty Boy. It's my only chance. Hurry. Place Hefty Boy into charging station now. No, oh, that is a. Press a button to acknowledge. It's no use, I can't break through his firewall. You need to find a way to cool him down. Cool him down. Um. So vielleicht? Wie können wir... Ah, vielleicht... Da hatten wir doch... Ist weg. Ah, ich weiß was. Wir nehmen den und... Legen ihn da rein. Place have to go into the wood. So, jetzt ist er kalt. Zit. Good, complete the upload. This is our only chance, pilot. From here on out, you are on your own. Uh, command, override OS. Here. Access, deny, entire root, uh, enter root registration password. Nochmal, nochmal, komm. D. 
see. D. A. Da haben wir den Kollegen auf den Heftiball geladen. Und das ist die einzige Kopie von ihm. Welcome to the elevator to the moon exhibit. Whoo, okay. Granted. Nee. Tja. Ähm, scheint so, als wäre das Ganze ein bisschen anders als gedacht. Rockmeyer ist also tot und der, den wir von Anfang an den, den, den wir da gesehen haben oder gehört haben, das war ein Klon, äh, alles eingefädelt von der AI, vom Vidal. Ähm, ja, der Vidal wurde jetzt auf dem Elevator oder im Elevator gelöscht. Wir haben den retten können auf den Hefty Boy. Der Rockmeyer hat sich wieder gemeldet und hat uns eine Rakete auf den Hals gehetzt und keine Ahnung, was als nächstes passieren wird, wenn wir da wieder rauskommen. Naja, ähm, sehen wir dann im vierten Teil. Ich hoffe, ihr seid wieder mit dabei, wenn es euch gefallen hat. Wie immer, liked, subscribed und kommentiert. Und bis dann, euer Mellow.